Okay, this is the relative polar coordinates. Uh, in relative polar coordinates, you simply specify the distance and the angle uh, using the format at, then specify the distance, and then angle symbol, which is simply the less than symbol. Okay, that is shift plus comma in the keyboard, and then you specify the angle, angle value, without the uh, degrees assigned. Okay. So, before we proceed with that, you should be familiar with the angle. In AutoCAD, okay, the positive x-axis is the reference uh, angle, which is 0 degrees. And then counterclockwise, uh, we read those angles are as positive. Okay, if you want to use the clockwise direction, so this is still the reference axis. So, if you're going to the counterclockwise, a uh, clockwise direction, this is negative 45 degrees, negative 90, and so on, okay? But then, I refer to the positive, okay? So, similar procedure, just manual method, okay? To invoke the manual method, pressing the F12 key will help you, okay? So, for this particular figure, point A is specified on this corner, then B, C, D, and point D, and then closing the figure, okay? Distance between A and B is 40. Distance between B and C is 40 again. C to D, 60. And D to E is given uh, 60 degrees. So I have provided you the procedures. Okay. And in the command, that should be similar to this one. Okay. Then you should practice it to give, build your own confidence. Okay. Let, let us try it with the AutoCAD itself. Okay. So I'll invoke the line tool, then specify the first point at 110, okay? So specifying the first point, it is always in absolute coordinate format, okay? 100 comma 10, that is at point A, okay? Now, uh, from A to B, okay? So the distance is 40, okay? So A is your origin, so this is positive X, so that gives lead us to a 180 degrees angle, okay? Or you can uh, use the clockwise direction, that is a negative 180, okay? So I'll just type in at, and then the distance is 40, okay? The less than symbol for the angle, and then that is a 180 degrees. Okay, so I'll just type in at distance and then the angle symbol followed by the corresponding angle, okay, which is 180. And then I'll press enter. Okay, now from point B to C, okay, so the distance between them is 40. So I'll type in at and then 40 with the angle symbol, okay, what will be the angle here? Okay, if this will be my reference point, okay, so this is the positive uh, uh, x-axis, so this is 0, then 90, 180, and then 270, okay, I could type in 270 here, or you can use the clockwise direction, okay, so that is simply negative 90, okay, but then I had you see here, 270 so probably I'll try negative 90 okay so that is negative 90 enter okay so it moved down okay now at point C to D okay that is a uh, so distance of 60 what angle should I have okay zero okay or you can use 360 degrees so let's try uh, at sign then then 60 angle symbol and then 360 okay so if you're going to use this one 270 and that comes back to zero which is 360 degrees okay now for d to e so that is a vertical so going up so that is simply at then 60 angle of 90 or if you want that could be a negative 270 if you want the clockwise direction, okay?
and then I'll just close the figure type in C then enter okay 